Are you curious about the medication abiraterone? Wondering about its side effects, uses, dosage, and mechanism of action? In this video, we are here to demystify abiraterone and provide you with all the essential information you need to know. Abiraterone is a commonly prescribed drug for the treatment of prostate cancer. While it has proven to be effective in fighting this disease, it also comes with certain side effects. It's important to be aware of these potential side effects so that you can recognize them and seek medical attention if needed. Furthermore, understanding the uses of abiraterone is crucial. Knowing which conditions it can help treat allows patients and healthcare providers to make informed decisions regarding its administration. Additionally, understanding the appropriate dosage and mechanism of action of abiraterone can ensure its safe and effective usage. Whether you are a patient, caregiver, or healthcare professional, this video will equip you with valuable knowledge about abiraterone. So, let us dive in and uncover the facts about this medication that plays a significant role in the battle against prostate cancer. Mechanism of Action of Abiraterone Abiraterone, also known by its brand name Zytiga, is classified as an androgen biosynthesis inhibitor. It works by inhibiting an enzyme called CYP17A1, which plays a crucial role in the production of androgens, male hormones, in the body, including testosterone. By blocking this enzyme, abiraterone reduces the production of androgens, which can fuel the growth of prostate cancer. The mechanism of action of abiraterone is twofold. Firstly, it inhibits the activity of 17 cypriot pounds A1 in the testes, adrenal glands, and tumor cells, thus reducing the production of androgens in these areas. Secondly, abiraterone also acts as a prodrug, meaning it is converted into a more active form called abiraterone acetate in the body. Abiraterone acetate further inhibits CYP17A1, leading to a more potent and sustained reduction in androgen levels. The reduction in androgen production achieved by abiraterone helps slow down the growth of prostate cancer cells and can lead to tumor shrinkage. However, it's important to note that abiraterone is not a cure for prostate cancer but rather a treatment that can help manage the disease and improve quality of life. Uses of abiraterone Abiraterone is primarily used in the treatment of metastatic castration-resistant prostate cancer MCRPC. This is a form of prostate cancer that has spread to other parts of the body and is no longer responding to hormonal therapy, such as surgical or medical castration. In combination with prednisone or prednisolone, abiraterone is commonly prescribed as a second-line or later treatment option for MCRPC. In addition to its use in MCRPC, abiraterone has also shown promising results in the treatment of earlier stages of prostate cancer. Clinical trials have demonstrated its effectiveness in combination with androgen deprivation therapy ADT, for patients with metastatic hormone-sensitive prostate cancer MHSPC. This combination therapy has been shown to improve overall survival rates and delay disease progression compared to ADT alone. Furthermore, abiraterone is being investigated for its potential use in other hormone-dependent cancers, such as breast cancer and ovarian cancer. However, more research is needed to determine its efficacy in these areas. Dosage and Administration of Abiraterone The dosage of abiraterone may vary depending on the specific condition being treated and individual patient factors. Typically, the recommended dose for MCRPC is 1000 mg, 4 250 mg tablets, of abiraterone acetate once daily, taken on an empty stomach at least one hour before or two hours after a meal. It is important to follow the prescribed dosing instructions provided by your healthcare provider. Abiraterone should be taken in combination with a low-dose corticosteroid, such as prednisone or prednisolone, to help manage potential side effects and enhance its effectiveness. The usual recommended dose of prednisone or prednisolone is 5 mg taken orally twice daily. It's important to note that abiraterone tablets should be swallowed whole with water and not crushed, chewed, or divided. This is to ensure the proper release and absorption of the medication in the body. Common Side Effects of Abiraterone Like any medication, abiraterone can cause certain side effects. These side effects can vary in severity and may differ from person to person. It's important to discuss any concerns or side effects with your healthcare provider to determine the best course of action. Some common side effects of abiraterone may include Fatigue Feeling tired or lacking energy is a common side effect of abiraterone. This can be managed by ensuring an adequate amount of rest and engaging in gentle exercise, if approved by your healthcare provider. Joint and muscle pain. Some individuals may experience joint and muscle pain while taking abiraterone. 
This can be alleviated by practicing gentle stretching exercises, applying heat or cold packs to affected areas, and using over-the-counter pain relievers, if appropriate. Hot Flashes Hormonal changes caused by abiraterone can lead to hot flashes, which are sudden feelings of warmth and sweating. Wearing lightweight clothing, keeping the environment cool, and avoiding triggers such as spicy foods or caffeine may help manage hot flashes. Hypertension Abiraterone can potentially increase blood pressure levels. Regular monitoring of blood pressure and following a heart-healthy diet, along with any prescribed medications, can help manage hypertension. Gastrointestinal upset Abiraterone may cause gastrointestinal symptoms such as nausea, diarrhea, or indigestion. These symptoms can often be managed with dietary modifications, such as eating smaller, more frequent meals, avoiding spicy or fatty foods, and staying hydrated. Fluid retention Some individuals may experience fluid retention, which can lead to swelling in the ankles, feet, or hands. Reducing salt intake, elevating the affected limbs, and wearing compression stockings may help alleviate this side effect. It's important to remember that not everyone will experience these side effects, and some individuals may experience different or additional side effects. Always consult with your healthcare provider for personalized advice and guidance. Rare but serious side effects of abiraterone. While rare, there are some serious side effects associated with abiraterone that require immediate medical attention. These side effects may include liver toxicity. Abiraterone can occasionally cause liver toxicity, which may manifest as yellowing of the skin or eyes, jaundice, dark urine, pale stools, or persistent abdominal pain. If you experience any of these symptoms, it is important to seek medical attention promptly. Adrenal insufficiency. Abiraterone can affect the adrenal glands, which produce hormones crucial for the body's normal functioning. Signs of adrenal insufficiency may include fatigue, weakness, weight loss, low blood pressure, and electrolyte imbalances. If you experience any of these symptoms, contact your healthcare provider immediately. Cardiac disorders. Abiraterone has been associated with an increased risk of certain cardiac disorders, such as heart failure or arrhythmias. It's important to monitor for symptoms such as shortness of breath, chest pain, rapid or irregular heartbeat, or swelling of the ankles, and report them to your healthcare provider promptly. Bone fractures. In some cases, abiraterone may increase the risk of bone fractures, if you experience sudden pain, swelling, or difficulty moving a limb, it is important to seek medical attention to rule out any potential fractures. These serious side effects are rare, but it's crucial to be aware of them and seek immediate medical attention if they occur. Regular monitoring and communication with your healthcare provider can help ensure the safe and effective use of abiraterone. Precautions and contraindications for abiraterone use. Before starting abiraterone, it is important to inform your healthcare provider about any pre-existing medical conditions, ongoing medications, or allergies you may have. This information will help your healthcare provider determine if abiraterone is suitable for you and if any precautions need to be taken. Abiraterone is contraindicated in individuals with severe hepatic impairment, as it can further exacerbate liver function abnormalities. It should also be used with caution in individuals with a history of cardiovascular disease or those at an increased risk of developing cardiac disorders. Additionally, abiraterone may interact with certain medications, including blood thinners, anticonvulsants, and some antibiotics. It's important to disclose all medications you are taking to your healthcare provider to ensure there are no potential interactions that could affect the safety and effectiveness of abiraterone. Interactions with other medications. Abiraterone has the potential to interact with other medications, which can affect their efficacy or increase the risk of side effects. Some medications that may interact with abiraterone include Anticoagulants Abiraterone may increase the effects of blood thinners, such as warfarin, and increase the risk of bleeding. Close monitoring of blood clotting parameters is necessary when these medications are used concomitantly. Anticonvulsants Certain anticonvulsant medications, such as phenytoin or carbamazepine, may decrease the effectiveness of abiraterone. Your healthcare provider may need to adjust the dose of abiraterone or consider alternative treatment options. Antibiotics Some antibiotics, such as rifampin, can decrease the concentration of abiraterone in the body, potentially reducing its effectiveness. It's important to inform your healthcare provider if you are prescribed or are taking any antibiotics to ensure appropriate management. These are just a few examples of potential drug interactions. It's important to disclose all medications, including over-the-counter medications and herbal supplements, to your healthcare provider to ensure safe and effective treatment. 
patient experiences and testimonials with abiraterone. Real-life experiences and testimonials from patients who have used abiraterone can provide valuable insights and perspectives. However, it's important to remember that individual experiences can vary, and what works for one person may not work for another. Always consult with your healthcare provider for personalized advice and guidance. Some patients have reported positive outcomes with abiraterone, including reduced tumor size, improved quality of life, and increased survival rates. Many have also noted that the side effects, while present, were manageable with appropriate support and medication adjustments. Others have highlighted the importance of open communication with healthcare providers and the need for a comprehensive approach to managing prostate cancer, including lifestyle modifications, emotional support, and regular monitoring. It's important to approach patient experiences and testimonials with an open mind, understanding that each individual's journey is unique. Your healthcare provider is the best resource to guide you through your own treatment plan and address any questions or concerns you may have. Conclusion and final thoughts on abiraterone. Abiraterone is a valuable medication in the fight against prostate cancer. Its mechanism of action, uses, dosage, and potential side effects have been outlined in this video to provide you with a comprehensive understanding of this treatment option. While abiraterone can be effective in managing prostate cancer, it's important to remember that it is not a cure. Regular communication with your healthcare provider, adherence to treatment plans, and following recommended lifestyle modifications are crucial for successful management of the disease. If you are considering or currently using abiraterone, remember to discuss any concerns or side effects with your healthcare provider. They will be able to provide personalized advice and guidance to ensure the safe and effective use of this medication. Prostate cancer is a complex disease, and each individual's journey is unique. By staying informed and working closely with your healthcare team, you can make empowered decisions and navigate this challenging path with confidence. Together, we can demystify abiraterone and continue to fight against prostate cancer. Thanks for watching.